Hi everybody, happy Valentine's Day weekend. I'm coming to you today to do an intuitive reading about what the hell is your ex thinking right now. Um, I'm in my ex-boyfriend's hoodie right here, going to channel some good ex energy, try to figure out what's on your person's mind. Thank y'all so much for liking, sharing, subscribing, all that good YouTuber stuff. I'm at almost 10,000 subscribers now, you guys. I cannot say thank you enough. So you haven't subscribed yet and join my weird little tarot family. Please go ahead and do that today. Also, if y'all are willing to donate to this single mama and my channel and all these crazy messages that I'm putting out, go ahead and do that. There's information in the comment section below in the description box below. Mercury retrograde, y'all. I can't even talk right. Anyways, here you go, you guys. Thanks so much. Here's your reading. Have a good one. What's up, Taurus? I'm gonna do an intuitive uh, little session here with you guys to find out what the hell is your ex thinking right now for this Valentine's Day weekend. Uh, this is a little different spread than I usually do. I'm just gonna pull random cards. Your ex is thinking right now that they're in the 10 of swords, man. They are dun, 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 dun. All right? If you think that they're having a good time right now, they are not, okay? This is the energy they're sitting in right now. Do you see this person all ripped to pieces right there? They've been shredded. There's not a shred of them left, okay? They've been utterly obliterated all right all right why does taurus this person feel this way why is taurus this person feeling like this ten of swords energy why are they feeling this way they're feeling that way because eight of swords They're in their own mental prison, all right, about what's going on here. Like, they have trapped themselves. I feel like this person has dug a hole that they cannot get out of now, and they are regretting it, okay? They feel stuck. Um, they feel like their hands are tied. They feel like they cannot come forward. All right, why does Taurus this person think that they can't come forward, or why are they feeling stuck? They're feeling stuck because they're out of balance. I got the temperance card right here. There's something in their life that's out of balance, okay? And whenever I see the temperance card too, I always, you know, I think about addictions. Look, there's a hookah up here. There's like, she's tripping on these mushrooms. This person could be dealing with um, some kind of an addiction problem, some kind of overdoing something. And I don't, it doesn't have to be substances, you guys. It can be a sex addiction. It can be, you know, just an addiction to anything, video games, whatever. This person is out of balance because they're putting too much focus on some kind of negative attachment that they have in their life all right there's something holding them back that's a negative attachment that needs to be dealt with and balanced out um let's see how does taurus this person feel about them at this current time how does taurus this person feel about taurus at this current time the fool <laughs> either they think you're a fool they think you're a damn fool literally okay or they're wanting to like jump back down this rabbit hole with you they're wanting a fresh new beginning they're wanting to start off everything new they're wanting a, a brand new start they want a clean slate all right they want to jump in again all right let's see what what's this fool about what is um taurus this person thinking with this fool energy page of wands they still have passion for you, Taurus. Like they still want you. They still look at you. They're still curious about what you're up to. They're still um, searching for you, I feel like. You're still very much energetically connected to this person. They do still wonder very much what you're up to, all right? And they are in, uh, They are thinking about coming back. Uh, so far, I'm not seeing like lovey-dovey energy right here. We're gonna keep going and figure that out. Like this is um, a passionate connection, like a physical attraction type thing. This isn't an emotional one. With that fool in the page of wands energy, that's foolish energy coming back at you, Taurus, that I wouldn't entertain if they're stepping like that. Um, I was going to ask, I'm not counting that because I didn't ask a question. What is Taurus's person um, wanting to talk about right now? The Knight of Pentacles. They are wanting to talk about, you know, starting this back up again but this the problem i got this for the uh, virgo reading too this guy is like super slow he's the super most slow knight in the deck like he does not you know do things rapidly like the knight of wands he is slow as molasses but he always gets the job done okay i do feel like this person is wanting to in the long term work things out with you um what's this uh, knight of pentacles about what do they want to come and work on what are they trying to stabilize here with this Knight of Pentacles? What are they trying to, you know, bring stability to and balance to? Why is this here? Ooh, that got popped out on the floor. What is that? 
We got the ten of, nine and ten of cups, all right? Right now, they're focusing on balancing themselves out. <clears throat> they're also still being guarded about whatever, whatever broke this up, whatever happened. They're still keeping some kind of secret, something close to the chest that they need to, like, let go of, all right? But they are thinking about, you know, the, um, they view you as, a, like, a, a trophy wife type situation, all right? And they're, they are scared of what other people think about this. I get in the background. They're wanting to like show show off or show off something to you is what I'm getting. Um, why do I get the inner energy that this person is trying to make you seem, you feel like they are in like a committed relationship that's making them look happy? All right, I'm going to ask a question for Taurus people that are um, dealing with a third party situation. What does Taurus's person think about the third party? What does Taurus's person think about the third party? Five of Cups. They aren't happy. You know, if they're putting on an air like they're happy right now, they are not, okay? They're still brokenhearted, whatever. I mean, I feel like whatever their situation is, it was all up front, okay? That just clarified this card. These people look fake as fuck to me. I don't know why. They just look fake, all right? They look like they're putting on airs. They're all dressed up for the court. They're like sharing, showing off or whatever. Um, I feel like this person has some kind of... They left to be in another situation and that situation went super sour, okay? And now they're like double heartbroken about everything. And they don't want to let anybody know that. They're still putting on these airs like everything's all good, like that they're stable, that they've got all their stuff together. They, I don't believe it, all right? What is Taurus's person's intention toward them? Knight of Swords with the Chariot. They're making a move on this and they're going to do it from an honest way, I'm saying, all right? Um, they're going to try to find a way to contact you. Look at uh, look in the background here. I'm an art reader, you guys. That person is bending over backwards, literally. And she's like bending this flamingo's neck and making it work for her. I got, this person is going to, um, I get that they're just going to bend over backwards to try to make you see, you know, their value or their worth or why you should take them back something like that i also got a feeling that this person made you bend over backwards or you bent over backwards for this person okay and they're coming in to tell you about that they're coming in to tell you you know i see what you've done for me i see how you've helped me out i see how you have you know put yourself out there for me to your detriment all right what else can you tell me about Taurus's person? There's still, uh, this person is putting up a front, okay? I feel like this person is just acting like everything's all good, like they're they're all right. But at the truth of the matter, you know, this, this is what's going on. And like, this is the first card I pulled for them. No matter how happy this person seems right now, they are bullshitting. I'd be surprised, I wouldn't be surprised if I saw the dang tower pop out. Like this 10 of swords energy, this person is um faking is what I'm getting. They're faking it, Taurus. What is Taurus's person feeling in their heart right now at this time? How is Taurus's person feeling in their heart right now at this time? The King of Cups, man. But I'm an art reader, okay? So this, <laughs> this King of Cups, yeah, he's the King of Cups, but look, he's in an ocean in the middle of nowhere by himself, all right? He's also holding this deck of playing cards in his hand. This person is playing games, all right? Regarding love is what I'm getting. And he doesn't look happy. Does that guy look happy to you? He does not look happy to me. He's still got this big ass cup. It's empty. There's nothing in it. There's no water in that cup. There's no love in that cup. He's sitting out in the middle of this ocean, playing this game, trying to play like he's got it all together, like he's the king of cups, like everything's all good. It is not that way, Taurus. I'm telling you, it is not that way. All right, what else can I get? How does Taurus's person feel about them in their heart? How does Taurus's person feel about Taurus? Ace of Wands, Six of Swords, Ten of Wands. All right, keeping all this bottled up, Taurus, or keeping on this charade is what I'm getting. Um, keeping on whatever this show is that they're putting on, this game that they're playing, is getting overly burdensome for this person. All right, it's about to break their damn backs. They can't do this anymore. Um, they're starting to come to the conclusion that they need to drop all those other sticks that we just saw in that Ten of Wands and like go with one and passionately pursue that is what I'm seeing. And I do see them doing that, all right? 
um, I get different energy from different six of swords. This is, um, this is the two of y'all sailing away together in this boat. All right. There's two people in this boat, two, and there's three swords behind each of them, which means both of y'all had a broken heart. You're putting those broken hearts literally behind you in this picture. You're getting in this boat together and you're sailing down this river to calmer waters is what's going on. All right, let me get one more. What's the final outcome for Taurus and their person? What's the final outcome here for Taurus and their person? We've got the Queen of Pentacles and the Knight of Wands, all right? This is passion. This is stability. This is, you know, this is Taurus energy, Queen of Pentacles here. This is big um, earth energy here. There's, there's going to be some movement towards trying to get this to a more grounded place. A um, couple knights showed up in this reading for this person. I, I, that is, it's not a page. You know, the page thinks about making the move. The knight actually does make, make the move. I feel like this person has already started making moves to bring this back into reunification somehow or to move away from just like the negative energy between you guys. They have made a move for it. They're trying to move to something more stable, okay? Whether or not that's with you, I do not know, Taurus. I don't, but I do see if they are in a third-party situation and acting like they're happy right now, they are not, okay? That is a big old fact. Uh, they do still have feelings for you. They do still think about you and want to reach out. It's a matter of will they do that or not. All right, Taurus, let me know in the comment section if that resonated with you. Love y'all so much. Thank you for hanging out. And if you have a chance to donate to this single mama here to keep this shit running, please do so. It's in the description box below. Love you guys.